sorry about that. Had to take care of a personal thing. What's up, Kahuna? Yeah, sorry about that. Nature was calling and I had to pick up. Give me one second again. How do I? Sorry, I'm trying to figure out something. Give me one more second. What's up, face stuffer? Did you watch the fights? No, what fights? Many fights, did not know. We're not particularly a viewer of them. Eh, that's good enough, screw it. Uh, I didn't watch the fights either? Oh, okay. Mm, 
this it should be good where are my Ritz crackers no wait a minute I almost got my Ritz crackers. Thoughts on haikus? I haven't heard a haiku poem in a long time, so... <laughs> I wouldn't know. I think it's like... Was it like five syllables, eight syllables, and then five syllables again? They're right, I guess. It's just been a while. Five seven five. Okay. Oh my god! For the love of God! getting worse at this <laughs> at this mini game come on DK okay I guess not
I'm supposed to be the bumper ball like champion. And yet I'm failing horribly. Dolan's fingers fly Mario Party 2 on the screen world record in sight. Yeah, truly, it's gonna happen today. World record, baby. Live in front of a studio audience. Exactly. You have to bring it up to fragments to really emphasize each point. Because it's happening today, buddy. Ah, oh, for the love of God. And it's... Oh, that's your haiku? Oh, I didn't catch on. That's, that's good. Well, there goes a run. But thank you for the beautiful haiku. Ultimate races, pressing buns with such grace, Mario wins the chases. By Face Stuffer, 2023. At least we have to go back through it again. I actually asked ChatGPT to write those. Oh, yeah, that thing. Well, now I have less respect for you. And that haiku. Just use a filthy AI. It knows who you are. There's no way that, uh, that AI knows about... Oh my god. Knows me in the, in the Mario Party 2 runs. There's no way. You probably had a feed of that information. GPT, Dalton is a popular speedrunner known for his experience in playing Mario Party 2. He's achieved world record times in various categories of the game, including minigame, island, and story mode. Dalton is known for his engineering person engaging streaming style, which has helped him build a large following on platforms like Twitch and YouTube. He continues to be an active member of the speedrun community and has inspired many other speedrunners to improve. There is no way. First of all, large, was it? Large following? I have three of the same viewers who come to my stream every single time. No, face over, send me a screenshot. I want a screenshot of your browser of ChatGPT saying that. I do not believe you. First of all, large following. I had the same three viewers every single stream. Every single one. 
I want a screenshot. I want I want the receipts, dude. There's no way. <laughs> There's no way an AI knows who a nobody Mario Party 2 speedrunner is. There's no way. If I'm not even known by like greater streamers or YouTubers, there's no way an AI someone knows who I am. What's up, Bonar? Thanks for the good luck. Also, face up for post it in chat. Don't get don't give it to me in Discord like some kind of scrub. Send it in chat so it's forever there. Appreciate the large pan over to the other other island. Mm -hmm. There's no way faced over there. Is just no way. She says it. Dalderman is a popular speedrunner known for his expertise in playing Mario Party 2. How does an AI know who I am? I have three viewers and started streaming like three years ago. The fuck? Nice. Oh my god. Well, that was close. Okay, that's awesome, actually. Faced over. Thanks, man. Nope. Dude, why is that a thing? Like, it's... Like, why? said I couldn't give you any strategies for the run though. That's right, I don't need any strats. I basically already know all of them. Damn it. I didn't press A on that. Yeah, I, I got all the strats, it's alright. I guess I do have a problem sometimes pressing A prematurely. And not the best one, but it's alright. Yeah. 
I asked it if you looked better with dreads and it told me... Commenting on someone's physical appearance can be considered inappropriate and disrespectful. <laughs> nice. The AI has got my back. And disrespectful, it's important to focus on an individual's accomplishments and skills rather than their appearance. Thank you. Chat GBT has got my back. Nice. I mean, I plan on getting my dreads back eventually, but... Nice. Makes me... Makes me feel good. And here comes Kuna to just kill the mood. Thanks, man. Yeah, the high kill is really good. You should probably go clean yourself up, Kuna. I'm gonna use that shit to write content for my company. I mean, why not? <sighs> there was a there was a lava mini game right there, and just didn't pick it. I used an AI writer a couple years ago, but this is way better. I mean, everyone keeps shilling out ChatGPT, so I guess it must be quality. In some regard. I paid like hundred dollars and still had to edit to sound normal. <laughs> nice. The progress is amazing. If anything, I should like, maybe even an hour later, I should put that chat GBT response in my Wikipedia article. For whenever I finally get famous enough to have a Wikipedia page, I'll just put that entire thing as like the, the main paragraph. I think you can write code, so can you just code itself to be better and better? Hey, yeah, true, you can. And then you can tell it to like, Change the new code from its old co from its old code, so it's like self-improving, self-learning. Nice. This sounds a lot a lot like the start to Terminator too. I don't mean I don't mean Terminator two like the sequel. I mean like Terminator also. Like this is this is the start of Skynet right here. When you get a chamace, check Jenner on your Discord. Can you just send it to me in chat so it's not you're distracting me? Like, do me a solid and don't require me to do the extra effort if you want to. If you want me to see something, just type it in chat. I don't know if I can. What is it like NSFW or something? Because. Okay, let me check this shit. That's not gonna be worth it. Yeah, I'm not reading all that. Send that in chat. I'm not reading all that in Discord. Where's John Connor? He's probably alive somewhere. Just gotta. Didn't change the settings. <sighs> Kuna wanted me to read a paragraph. He sp he just typed in the Discord. Like I'm not reading all that, dude. Are you kidding me? I just missed the settings. I'm not sure if there's like even a full sentence in that like paragraph. It was just a huge block of text. Dude, I gotta focus on the run. World record is gonna happen today. Am I a bad person? No, you're just. Am I a better person for laughing at that? Laughing at what? If it's something. F oh, I mean like your thing killing my run? 
I mean, no. If it was funny, then you're supposed to laugh at it. Yeah, give me the TLDR. Yeah, I, I keep forgetting about that. Kuna, whatever the fuck you just typed in that giant spam, give me a one-sentence TLDR synopsis. Because I am not reading all that. Sorry. It reads like a green text. It'd be better if you put it in green text format, like with the... The, you know, the open... The greater than sign, less than sign, or whatever. Man, here's a song by Dream and starts jerking off furiously. <laughs> okay, see, that would have been... That's... That right there... That, that's better. The main point is there, and it's much funnier. Thank you for that. That's, okay, that's pretty cool. Yeah, chat has like a... As an unwritten policy, don't write me paragraphs, just give me a TLDR. Because it's going to be much quicker and probably be funnier. Thank you. That's pretty good. He didn't say no homo. I mean, it's not... It's not to do it to do that to a dream song. Yes. What's a libido? It's like you're... Oh, I didn't change it again. I'm too busy answering sex-based questions like I'm a sex ed teacher. It's like your um, amount of like uh, willingness to make a whoopee. To, you know, get down and dirty. If you have low libido, then you don't have as much energy or want to, you know, do the nasty. So you were whacking it during a Zoom call to your favorite Minecraft YouTuber song. <laughs> Face up, you're making a lot of assumptions here, man. Yeah, like Whoopi Goldberg, exactly. <laughs> I mean, face over, a lot of people have, you know, different different ways of getting their, getting themselves, uh, you know, going, ready. Also, I think I just showed my age, because I, I said the term making whoopee, and that is a super dated term for, you know, you know, that's, that's a really old term. Which I'm pretty sure derives from Whoopi Goldberg. You leave your location too, you're slipping. When did I leak my location? What? I definitely never did that. Also, wait, you already know where I'm located. I'm in Vatican City, of course. Although you're about to die inside and out. Oh yeah, I've seen that. Uh, that thing. Spam, yeah. I'm not. I, I'm not dead. I'm just it's disgusted, really, by that paragraph. Yeah. So I've already leaked my location. I'm in the Vatican. Everyone already knows that. How? I don't know, just from like random YouTube like meme compilations and accidental finds on TikTok. Because TikTok just sends you out crap. And I've seen that before. I'm pretty sure even like probably Breezy or someone when I was like uh, streaming way back in the day sent me something like that. I've been around way too long to not see something that stupid. I've had to do it again. Oh! Alright, I'm gonna keep it going because this is a good, um. This is a good minigame. I keep forgetting to do it. I need advice. I'm sure, what kind of advice? 
I'm happy to dispel some sage wisdom. How do I get my wife to stop sending me TikToks on Facebook? <laughs> um... <laughs> now that is a very interesting conundrum. To get your wife to stop sending you TikToks on Facebook, either block your wife on Facebook, or... I would say delete her Facebook account, but then she'll just make a new one. Hmm. Oh, I got it. I got face up. Okay. To get your wife to stop sending you TikToks, tell her that you made uh, an alt Facebook account. Actually make one. And tell her that, oh, okay, I'm actually using this account, so send it to this one. But then you'll you never have to receive those TikToks, so you just you'll just use your regular account. So just get her to send those TikToks to the alt account and then say, oh yeah, I saw that TikTok, that was very funny. Just, just say something, you know, whatever. And then you never have to see those TikToks again. I tried to ignore them, but then she'll ask me at dinner if I saw the, that funny video. I mean, yeah, at that point you just say, say something generic like, oh yeah, that was pretty funny. Like, I, like at first it seemed kind of, you know, like a silly video, but then, yeah, kind of... You just, you just kind of like spew out a word stew that seems convincing. Yeah, see, I'm always happy to dispel some, you know, relationship advice, some sage wisdom. I got a lot up in here. Always happy to help. <laughs> Do you have a... Doll Dusty. No, I do not. Because I'm not 14 years old. Thank you for asking. <laughs> yes, yeah, it's, it's that stupid term bussy that, like, only TikTokers use. And since I'm not one of those, and I'm not like 15 or 14 years old. No, I do not. Because I don't use that type of language. Like saying mid or cap. Yeah, that's just... I'm, I'm almost disgusted with myself when I say those words. Or like I think about almost saying it. I'm not giving that definition, Kuna. Just Google it. <laughs> you uh, use the power of Google. Oh yeah, or the skull emoji. I'm, I'm so tired of seeing that. I am literally too old to use that type of jargon, or like, that language. I have too much self-respect, you know. Annoying is definitely one word to describe it. I'm so old I can st I still call them emoticons. I do that sometimes as well. Or to like, to purposely show my age and my hatred of them, I call them emoji cons. So like, I still somewhat, you know, have the base name emoji, but then ruin it at the end with con. Although I kind of have a fetish for watching cringe compilations. I mean, that makes sense, because cringe compilations sort of give you a nice um, cathartic experience. You feel better about yourself watching these people do something cringe. I used to do it all the time. Boomer vibes indeed. Although I would say vibes is definitely a zoomer term. <laughs> but it's a nice juxtaposition. Nice. 
used to be cringe. No, I'm not saying I used to be cringe. I used to watch cringe compilations. Of course I'm not cringe. What? Oh yeah, hippies did start saying vibes first, true. Yeah, never mind. Yeah, vibes is a boomer term, but then the zoomer try to appropriate it. As they do with all terms. I think Zoomers say Vibin instead. I, I've never heard him or like seen that being used widely, but okay. It's a zoomer, it's what you are, Kahuna. <laughs> yeah, you have some weird fascination. I would say damn near obsession faced up with uh, Fat Sonic. I don't know why. Ah, <laughs> uh, no. How does one get the horny for making characters fat? I don't know, it's like... It's the crazy thing about human... About humans. Stop hitting it. Oh my god. I'm hitting the shell accidentally. Oh, it's also like a video game, like a fan game. Making characters fat or like, I think it's called like inflation or whatever, is one of those fetishes I never understood. Oh, I just got banned off TikTok, nice. That is a damn record. What's up, Anthony? I got, I got banned for bullying and harassment. Yeah, I decided to stream again on TikTok, and I got banned for bullying. No. Appeal. Submit. Because you're harsh on Kahuna? Oh my god, there is no way TikTok thought me bantering with Kahuna was me, was me bullying him. I was obviously not bullying or harassing Kahuna, the fuck. You know what? Also, normally I don't use these Gen Z terms. I am doing I'm doing it here because I find it funny that you hate it. I mean kinda, yeah. I guess it's kinda funny. He was harassing me, I wasn't. <sighs> but th this happens every single time I go live. For like a- for the first like 30 couple minutes or whatever. It's good and then TikTok things I'm either bullying someone, harassing someone, I have sexual based content or something. Every single time this happens. Is it because you said fat? Maybe. Because, like, I, I was bantering with Kahuna, right? I talked about Fat Sonic, and I said how I don't understand fat... Fat fetish. And I, I, was about, I was about to start talking about cuck fetish as well, but I thought that, that may have been too far. So I didn't mention it. So it must, be, it must have been either talking about Kahuna or talking about fat people. Or fat fetish. Yeah, I did appeal it. I mean, technically, you have a sexy voice. I guess, yeah, they, they just thought I was... It's just nothing but sex on my stream. Cuck is short for cuckold. It's a thing where dudes like to watch their ladies 
their lady or woman have sex with a different man and like to like watch and view it yeah I, I i never know what why i've been banned it gives a vague reasons like bullying so i just i'll just stomach it it doesn't matter i'll probably get um i'll get my access back probably if they if they see that it's a fallacious reason in like maybe a couple hours If it's seriously because I said the word fat, then it's whatever. Because there are certain hoops with language I will not jump through, okay? Like, I'm a man, I know what I want to say, and I'll say what I want to say. Like, there's, a, there's only so much of myself that I can sanitize and, like, smooth out the edges. To the point I don't become, I I am no longer myself. Like I'm not doing that, man. Come on. So, again, it's a fallacious reason. So, if TikTok sees the same way, I'll get my access back in, in a couple hours. <sighs> Fuck. Respect that. Thank you, man. Oh, it's me. Nice. Let's hear a controversial rant then. I mean, I have I don't really have anything controversial like a controversial opinion or anything about anything. Or if I do, it's about a very stupid topic. Or give me a topic chat and then I'll see if I have a controversial opinion about it. ChatGPT got upset when I asked it to write a fat joke, so I asked it to write a joke about being extremely hungry and gluttonous instead. It's nice to know that ChatGPT is an ally to the fat people. Was Kanye, Kanye right about the Jews? Uh... I'm not sure what he said, but no, he was not, whatever he said about them. Why did Kanye wear a bondage mask? Maybe because he's secretly interested in bondage stuff? Because he wanted to have hardcore sex with Alex Jones, that's also probably why. Did George Floyd die from the knee or fentanyl? I think it was the knee. From even the very little that I saw, I think it was the knee. Nice. What's fentanyl? You definitely know it. I mean, it's, it's a drug, essentially, Kahuna. It's a drug. Sandy Hook hoax? I don't know. I just know that it was a it was a tragedy at a school. I seriously doubt they would they would hoax a bunch of dead kids. It's like heroin. I mean, I definitely know nothing about drugs. Face stuff for you're the drug expert, so I'll just take your opinion on that. Guys, I don't live in the USA, I don't know what these Gen Z terms mean. Oh, you're not? This entire time, Kahuna, I thought you were, uh, American. <laughs> I guess that's, that's an assumption on my part. Democrat or Republican? I'm neither. That is the dumbest choice you can make. Cocaine or Molly? Neither, preferably? I don't want to do either. I'm from South America, Paraguay? Really? Interesting. Cool. God real? I don't know, like, evidence God is real. 
I have no good evidence that he's real and no good evidence that he's not real, so... I'd say he's probably not real. Oh, it's a free hoe. Condom or sheep intestine? I think I'll just take the condom, thank you. I definitely don't have a controversial opinion about condoms. Sex or no sex? I definitely prefer to have sex. <laughs> That's not controversial. Yeah, there's no, I have nothing controversial about sex. That's pretty simple. We still bumping R. Kelly? I've never listened to R. Kelly. I, I know he made that one song, um... I Believe I Can Fly, I think. I kind of like that song, but that's it. I don't actively bump his music. So, no. Oh. Knitted condom or paper condom? I guess paper condom? That sounds kind of painful, though. Thoughts on R. Kelly's sentence? Probably justified given that he urinated on an underage girl. So it's, it's probably justified. Owl City made that one song like Fireflies or something, right? That's the only song I know about them. That's it. Is Kendrick wrong for using the F word? He used the F word recently? I mean, I don't listen to Kendrick, I wouldn't know. Uh, f I th my thing is that you can only use those words if you're part of the afflicted group. So unless Kanye is, I mean, not Kanye, unless unless Kendrick Lamar is part of that group, then he, then he can probably say it. If not, then probably not. How to mine Bitcoin? I don't know. Get a Bitcoin miner? Thoughts on Bill Cosby returning to stand-up comedy? Is he really returning to stand-up comedy? <laughs> that's that's going to be interesting, definitely. I definitely won't watch it, but that sounds interesting. How many genders are there? Two, I believe. And even if you're part of the group, then maybe don't say it either. And I'm just saying, like, in terms of relative relative okayness with saying it, it'd be better if you're part of that group. John Starzinski quit job. Why? I don't know who that is. Cosby said he was going to go this year. That's just weird. Like, it's kind of hard to go back into, you know, the business... I mean, your reputation has been that destroyed and that that much ruined. So I don't know how he's going to do it. How many cups of flour is one quarter? I don't know. What? Whenever I hear in terms of I get PTSD from a certain pasta. I don't know what pasta that is or which one you're talking about. Pro or anti abortion? Mm. I don't know. I care so much about having children and like safeguarding their lives. It's kind of hard, so maybe. Anti, I guess? Fuck. You think he'll tell a, tell a rape joke? Yeah, probably. To make like light of the situation and see like it's all, he's all playful with it when. It's kind of hard to do that when you when you've actually you know, raped someone, multiple people. It's kind of hard to do that. Dude, in abortion, it's like you're killing a child, but like it's not born yet. Oh, what's up, wounded? True. Would you stick your dick in a random pipe on street? No, I wouldn't. What the f- no. Why would I do that? Oh yeah, wounded. Uh, <laughs> Chad is asking me, like, if I have any controversial opinions about anything, so they're just, they're just giving me topics. 
to like see if I have a you know controversial take or opinion about it. Dolman is is anti woman's rights. I'm definitely not. I'd not say that. Was Hitler right? No, he wasn't. <laughs> Obviously not. You know, it'd be pretty funny, Chad, if this world record in this entire conversation was in the in the world record VOD. That'd be really funny. Dollar opinion, opinions on Fortnite recently adding male jiggle physics. <laughs> Sounds like a great addition to the game. Was Huey Newton right? Oh, wait, wasn't Huey Newton the... Wasn't that the founding member of the Black Panthers, if I remember correctly? I'm not sure what he said, but... I'm not sure what he was right about. Did the CIA carry out 9-11? No, Bush. Bush was the mastermind by 9-11, obviously. Oh, he was? Okay, I'm not sure what Huey said, though. I just know he was the founding member. He probably had some heavy, like, anti-white sentiment, of course. Is Bin Laden still alive? I don't think so. I think he's pretty dead. Did Kennedy perform oral on his bodyguards? Yes, he did. Most definitely. Should guns be banned from the US? No. Absolutely not. You definitely need guns to defend yourself. Did the Clintons still fuck? No, there's no way. There's no way they did. What holds black people back the most? I would say honestly black people. There seems to be a lot of self-hate in the black community. It's strange. Mm, close. Is Trump's ass crack huge? Yes, most definitely. Yes, it is. Eating feces good for you? No, it's not. Please do not, chat, consume your feces. Just as a general, as a general health warning. Depends on your type of feces, no, just don't eat your feces in general. Was the COVID vaccine useful? Maybe, I don't know, I didn't get the vaccine, I wouldn't know. If you had a time machine, but could only go back to kill Hitler, would you do it? Butterfly effect might be crazy. Oh, it definitely would be crazy. Um... I kill Hitler? Probably... I would. I wouldn't kill Hitler. Now, bro, I don't want a butterfly, butterfly effect. Okay. Then why do people consume the coffee beans that are ground from cat or monkey poo? I'm assuming they wash the beans. They don't just pick up the raw beans from the crap. Like, fresh. You gotta wash them. Eating your own boogers good for you? No, it's not. Don't eat, don't eat your own boogers. Was BLM a scam? For some of it, it was because the money was actually going to good black causes or helping out black Americans. It was just being funneled into the pockets of the organizers. Is hentai good for the elderly? No, it's not. So you will drink that coffee? I hate coffee. I am never drinking coffee. Yeah, first, at first, uh, 
things always start off good with or with organizations or um like group focused things, but then always later on it gets tainted and ruined. What's behind the fucking now section on the hub? I haven't been on Pornhub in forever, I don't know. Why isn't my sperm blue? Uh, I don't know, CD Ram, you should probably go to a doctor. <laughs> You should go back on dude. They're giving away five PS5s. I don't want a PS5. Should drugs be decriminalized everywhere? I kind of think so. Whenever I was like slightly into politics or like political matters, I kind of saw the stupidity of criminalizing drugs. Especially things with like weed and whatnot. Because, like, it's it's a very minor drug. The person is voluntarily consuming it. Like, what right does the government have over something like that? If you're dumb enough to take... Uh, that's I shouldn't probably say that. I should not say that, actually. Never mind. Shit. When's the last time you failed the misery with a woman? Uh, I mean, there's so many times I did that. Anthony, <laughs> you gotta specify which time. There's like a lot of them. How often do you think masturbation should be done to be unhealthy? You probably shouldn't masturbate at all. Instead, probably find like a girlfriend or a wife instead. You think eight? Face effort, you probably said that because you have masturbated eight times in one day. Like a massive degenerate. Yeah, don't masturbate, just get a girlfriend, please. Good luck on the runs, thank you, Ram. I'm kidding, my sperm. It's not blue, it's pearl white. Nice. Tell us about the absolute worst time. I don't know, man, my memory's both bad and it feels like I have so many of those experiences. Maybe not, maybe not I failed miserably with a woman, but... Just like, it's a, just a rejection or like, something good didn't happen. Masturbate with your girlfriend. You could do that. That's less... Like, weird, I guess. Ever got cheated on? No. Dude, dude, this is, dude, this is world record. Why is this happening? Man, this is world record. Why am I getting this mini game? Chat, as you can plainly see, this is world record. It's happening, but I'm losing so much time. So, I'm just now realizing too how good this run is, but we're too busy talking about like the last time we masturbated or f do I believe in women's rights and shit? Like, should the death penalty exist? Yes. Ever had a pregnancy scare? No. I know you are, Anthony. <laughs> you just. This is random crap. I'm too busy right now of actually focusing on the run and realizing that I'm losing so much time. Like, this is, this is actually world record, and everyone is dying horribly. Would you fuck a police officer? I mean, yeah, sure, if she, like, if you were, like, dating and she was, like, you know, a nice woman, sure. I'm glad you're having a good time, face stuffer. Oh, my run's dying. She? 
I'm definitely not gonna have sex with a male police officer. I'm not gay. A police woman with a big booty, heck yeah. Yeah, definitely. It sounds awesome. Should the government provide a universal income to everyone? I don't know. I feel like doing that may incentivize laziness in some in people. And laziness is a... Oh, damn it. Laziness is a horrible vice. Dude, my run... Chad, this is actually world record. I. It's actually world record and it's dying hard. Is the object of this to go through the runs as fast as possible regardless of winning or to get first place? Getting first place is a requirement, yeah. It doesn't matter if you win the minigames, you just have to get to the end of, uh, end of the board and have the most amount of stars. But right now my world record run is dying so hard. Should... How much money is enough for you to be gay for one night? <laughs> Uh, $25,000. Thank you for asking. Should male maleness be legalized? Yes, it should. <sighs> arm, the, arm the homeless with a Glock. Sure. Focus, you fuck. Okay, I want to, but I was having a good time talking with Chad about nonsense, but... Yeah, Chad, this is world record, so I kind of have to pay attention right now. It's... Like, Chad, no joke, this is world record. Alright. I'm not panicking, I'm just like, I'm I'm trying to handle both this world record speedrun and having a good time with Chad. Yeah, that minigame was good. After that horrible... Um... Honeycomb Havoc, that was really good. Strangest thing to to make you hard? <sighs> like me personally? I don't know, maybe like a drawing of a woman instead of the actual thing? Should prostitution be legalized? I think so, kinda. <sighs> okay. Dude, run is dying hard, please, 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 please. He's having a good time with the nonsense questions. I mean, I am. It's, just a, it's a good time just talking to chat about nonsense and bantering. So Hitler was right or not? Hitler was incorrect. Okay, DK, don't get four. It doesn't matter if it's four. All right. Should hate speech be excluded from freedom of speech? The only type of speech that should be banned is one that incites... Come on, man. Incites uh, violence. Like a call to action for violence or assault. If you're just talking about a thing, like a, like a just a thing, idea, whatever, you know it should be allowed. But if you're actually telling people to, hey, because of these things, go out, do these things, hurt these people, destroy this property, nah, nah that's that's not allowed. Nah, bro, that's too normal. Like once I got hard looking at a field officer. Dude, do this run. This run is so good. And then Luigi, fuck. This can still world record, but dude, I am losing so much time to stupid shit. I'm, I'm, this run is dying in the worst ways. I'm choking slowly and slowly. Hey, pff, awesome. Okay, good mini game. Good mini game. Good mini game. That's good enough. What's up, babe, man? You've tuned into my world record run, dying in the last moment, as always. 
I think this is still world record. It's just, uh, it's so bad. Okay, nice. Th this should world record. Th this has to be. Minus four minutes insane potential? It is, but dude, I lost it so bad to so many stupid, stupid stuff. Yeah, this is world record, baby. There we go. Finally, baby. I did, I, dude, I did get honeycomb on like turn 18. It was so cringe. It was so cringe, but dude, world record, I don't care. Safranak thinks he can come into my territory and steal my world record. Safranak, you poor, poor fool. You poor fool. Hi, YouTube. Nice. I'll take that, man. Dude, uh, it was... Dude, the time save was so good. I just lost it to a lot of dumb shit. But, dude, world record, baby. I'll take that. Dada don't like big booty police women. No, I do. I most certainly do. Of course I do. Alright, chat. That's world record back. Safranak thought he can come in and steal it. Nope, I got it back, baby. As I, as I always tell you, chat. The four magic words. Never doubt the mad lad. Never do it. Never doubt me. Can you do it again? I didn't see it. <laughs> no, I'm not doing it, dude. I already got my world record back. I'm moving on to the next record. Come on. But, okay, hold on. As per tradition, chat posted to Twitter. <laughs> Safranek, you are banned from Easy Coaster. I'm pretty sure Safranek is, is asleep right now, but... Nah, he's gonna wake up in a cold sweat thinking... Oh no, Dolomet, he's back! He's back with the world record runs. Got my record back from Safranek and Pirate. On to... Horror Land. Thanks for the GG's everyone. Thank you Freeho, Wounded, CDRAM, Anthony. Kahuna, Jugum72, Ape, everyone, thank you very much. And the worst part, Chad, um, I don't have, um, wait, how'd you submit an image? The... That's pretty cool. I got so fucking hard when the timer stopped, nice. That's a nice looking image right there. But yeah, cool. War record baby. Very nice, very nice. Um I think I said everything I had to say. I said all the things. Yeah. Um Okay, let me uh save splits thirty eight fifty two. Yeah, now yeah, th that grind is grind is done now, chat. The next one the the next record I think Saf stole was from Horrorland. He beat my Horrorland record, so I'm gonna grind on that one. I'm not gr I'm not gonna grind on it. I'm, tr I'm going to grind to get that record back. Thanks thanks all that no problem man. Dada, why you have a heart on? I don't. That the pants make it look wrong. Also yeah, I need to change the image. I forgot about that. Instead of having the the split bot change images randomly since it's broken I'm gonna change the image once every stream that's the best thing I can do yeah grind on the horror line exactly there's like some ghost poles I can practice my moves on I know I saw it I saw the post uh, let me change the picture to uh... thanks for raiding me yesterday oh yeah no problem None of my other cogs were live, and I was like, I thought about, you know what, let me actually raid him. He's playing some awesome Warzone. 
There we go. Okay, yeah, so next is Horrorland. Oh, yeah, I, I didn't update the splits for that one, though. How's my gameplay? I didn't watch because I had to go to sleep. So, but I'm assuming you did a very fantastic, fantastic job. You got a dub, very nice. Oh, someone submitted a run. Dude, so many people have been submitting runs for Mario Party 2 recently, I've noticed. Like, like there's been a recent wave of just like, so many people submitting runs. Was it Drop Mania? No, his name is, it's Beef. Yeah, I know I submitted a run, but I'm talking about like, like other people, there's been a lot of, there's been a giant influx of runs. That's the, oh, that's the worst part. I don't have any cake because I ate it like a couple days ago and I didn't buy any more cake for world record. Oh yeah, I think I remember seeing that guy. Yeah, and it's beef. Yeah, a lot of people are submitting Mario Party 2 runs. Eat something? I have a Ritz cracker. <laughs> Eat something controversial. Cracker. I'm submitting a new record to switch normal coaster in 10 minutes. Great. <laughs> the racist man, shake my head. I'm not even racist. Oh, I hear this. I hear this horror land. Yeah, Saffron and I got a 40 45 17 years ago. I didn't bring up my Horland splits. Yeah, maybe. Wait. You made it famous. I thought I, I thought I saw someone say say I'm that I'm famous or something. I'm definitely not famous though, Chad. But definitely getting up there. I would maybe. I'm glad the controversial run was in the world record. Oh yeah, that's even better, Chad. I love it when um, when a PB VOD or um, a world record VOD has a bunch of funny moments from streaming it. And in, in, in that entire run, was just nothing but Chad asking me stupid questions about if I have a controversial opinion about like Hitler, women's rights, uh, would I go gay for money, like all of those. I love it when a VOD has that. That's, that's always the best. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna do one, I'm, I'm getting on my splits right now. But I, I like to have the world record splits side by side with mine. So I have to like quickly add them in. All you need is some controversy to get famous. I don't want to get famous from controversy. That's that's horrible for, for the brand. Yeah, you, you had some questions in there, free ho, nice. So you love gay porn? No, I never said that. Oh wait, did I already add Saf splits? Was, was I that prepared? Well, yeah, Chad, I think I already added Saf splits because I, because I knew I was gonna get back the record. Did I already do that? Turn one to two fifty. Yeah, I already did that. Wow, I am good. I am good like that, man. Yeah. Okay, the grunt work has been done. I already added Saf's world record splits. So we're good. On to the next grind, chat horror land. Fight Jake Paul or some shit? Nah, that's that's cringe, no. Th those YouTuber fights? No. I have way too much self-respect to do that. Do a chess fighting event or something? I kinda like chess, maybe. Ape Duden versus Dudman Mario Party 2 web play? Oh yeah, we could do that. We, we can set up like a netplay server for Mario Party 2. And then we can do like... Like who, who you know, wins the most amount of mini games or gets the most amount of stars. We can definitely do that. That would be fun to do a me, Dala, Silo, and Gurby's board. I would definitely do that. I, I do, I so want to play Mario Party 2 with Silo. He's like my hero. Hey, hey but if you can organize that, I am definitely in. 
I, I am most definitely in. Gerbys would definitely be up for that. That is that sounds awesome. All right, I need to I need to firm up on the strats again for Horrorland. Okay. I don't know Silo Silo's kind of like on and off. He's like an enigma. He's like sometimes here and then sometimes not. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what he really does, but if you can somehow get in contact with the man and get him in, I'm I'm definitely there. Oh yeah, he yeah. Um, wait, still recording? Okay, good. Yes, that's the one thing. Silo is always lurking in Mario Party 2 stream, so he's still within the community. So that's kind of good. Oh yeah, and if not, then Safranak can always jump in, because he's... I love that dude as well. Silo is my hero. Oh yeah, Gerby's too. No, I mean... <laughs> no, Gerby's is not related in that category. I say Silo because he was my original, like... Like, opponent slash guide when I started doing Mario Party 2. So he's like my... He's like my, uh... My mentor, like the inspiration, if you will. Gerbys is just a fellow competitor and runner. Can I show you my Mario Party 2 mod application? I would like to apply to be a new mod for the leaderboards. I'm doing I am doing more runs for this game, and in ineptly inspiring more people to do runs. I want to offer my services to assist with a possible massive backlog and speed things up. Thank you. That's right, Kahuna. The backlog is manageable, but thank you for the. Are you going straight to Horrorland? Yeah. Like I, I just got back my old world record for Powerland. Now we move on to the next one. The grind does not stop, baby. Like I'm still here. I'm still awake. Might as well grind it, grind another world record. Eh, so good like that. I'm so good. Oh, wait, it's already yeah, it's already set. Damn it. I'm glad I taught you well, Dada. Yeah, thank you, wounded. I like to apply to be. Oh, you just copy and pasted it. <laughs> Who's narrow? Why should I ban narrow? Nice spliced first run. It's not spliced. Or I should say, Frio, you have no evidence that I spliced this run, so... Just don't say anything and the mods won't know, alright? I would definitely not grind on a man, no. I, that professional emo looks so good, I'm, I'm glad I added it. It's clean and simple. It's not gay. I mean, the rainbow coloring is kind of suggestive, but. All right. Which more party minigame would be the best as a fleshed out full game? I don't know, like a lot of them are kind of too short and simple. Um. I don't know, that's... Yeah, it's, they're, a lot of them are too short to be fleshed into a full thing, a full game, I think. You calling the gay simple? That's controversial. I wasn't calling the... <laughs> I wasn't calling the gay simple, I said the design of the professional emote is simple. Bomb on Barrage, but it becomes bullet hell. That'd be kind of awesome. Yeah. 
Man, it feels nice to actually like be back into it. Be back in the grind. Get back a world record. Feels good. There could be a different there'd be different stages of the same minigame concept, high difficulty and such. I was just thinking about maybe something with Honeycomb Havoc. Maybe like a marathon style where Maybe like a marathon styled Honeycomb Havoc. Or like I don't know, Anthony, that's just a that's a really new type of question. I forge you don't have an answer for it, sorry. Shy guy but with five flags? That'd be kinda interesting. Like instead of one shy guy, there's like two or three of them. You need to, you have to press up all three flags that they write that they raise. The entire bumper balls game, I would buy and play that game every single day. Short stream, yeah, I'm, I'm doing a short stream today. I was initially going to quit after a few attempts at Pyroland, but I got world record out of the blue, so I was like, I might as well do some Horrorland runs. Haven't, haven't even F tonight. Oh, yeah, that's even the weirdest part. Not a single F. I was, I was expecting to do at least twice, but no, I have a clean stream, clean flow. It's amazing. So, Dalda, would you eat out an old man's dirty shit-stained ass for $1 million? No. Uh, no, I would not. Why not? Because I just don't want to. Therapy can fix anything after, but it takes time and I'm lazy. Uh, that's also a good point. I mean, if I can eat his ass and then, like, get that Men in Black Flash Memory Eraser thing, then sure. Because <laughs> I don't want to remember doing that. The million dollars would be nice, though. It would be. But if they give you hand sanitizer... <sighs> Maybe? I don't know. I didn't say yes, I just said that there may be, there has to be more conditions to it. You're a nasty? Okay, whatever. <laughs> you believe whatever you want, chat. You believe whatever you want. Yeah, that's why I said no in the first place. Like, a million, a million dollars is nice, but at some point, like, mental scarring is an issue. I know the ice is thin. Imagine there's a rich old man that just shattered himself in chat. I don't think rich old men watch Mario Party 2 speedruns, but... Uh, what do I know? Chad always wins. Yeah, they do in the end. It's kind of like... Like in retail, they say the customer's always right. Chat, in a way, is always kind of right. So, like, always wins. So. Shitting in an open field is better than sex. I would not know that. I've never done that. I'll take you as the expert. Oh, you got an actual... Ah, uh, get fucked. Loser. Sorry about that. I think I like... Like, I had like spit in my mouth. Like... I was gen- I was <coughs> I was like generating a spitball and then like... Trying to swallow it, but then sometimes- like at the same time... 
trying to speak at the same time, so I was choking on the spit or something. I don't know. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> oh, dude, I hate this minigame so much. 